Good evening and thanks for watching tonight. I'm Matt Davenport. And I'm Marlee Serby. The two newest Pocatello City Council members reveal the city's new plan to hold town hall meetings. KPVI News That Works For You journalist Kate Gardner tells us what that plan aims to achieve. This is a municipal corporation and it is very difficult for the stockholders, the public, who pay the bills to have um, significant input. The Pocatello City Council decided that the public should have more input in city issues at last week's council meeting. Really, everyone on the council um, was, was more than willing, including the mayor, to have town halls. So that was very exciting to me. Council meetings are open to the public, but protocol makes it hard for residents to really voice their concerns. And it's something many voters want. I got a lot of feedback back saying, gosh, we just want to be able to talk to you. Uh, in a comfortable situation. So the council came up with a solution. What better way to give people a, 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 a forum to, to express their concerns and, and share their ideas about their particular neighborhoods than to have, you know, town hall meetings. And when the council does start having those meetings, council members hope to create a certain atmosphere in order for the meetings to be successful. If you have a concern, who am I to say you shouldn't have that concern? Um, if, if we achieve that kind of tone, then I believe people will continue to show up. And to the citizens who do show up to the future town hall meetings, council members promise to listen. So I'm going to be here and I'm going to be more than willing to listen to anybody, whoever that person is. I don't have to agree, but I do have to listen and I do have to acknowledge that that is a real concern for that person. In Pocatello, Kate Garner, KPVI News That Works For You. A date hasn't been set for the first town hall meeting, but it will most likely be in February and will be held at the city council chambers.